Hey everybody, it's Rental Robert with the No Pay No Stay Network. We're coming at you today. Hope it was a good day. Feeling a little bit better. I'm going to the dentist tomorrow morning early. See about some relief with this tooth right here. However, I'm not very optimistic and uh, we're about to have to spend a bunch of money to get some tooth fixed in this head. So it is what it is. I'm just very thankful to God that uh, right now I've got the resources to be able to float that and uh, and do it, you know, so something came up, got the video, the dump trailer or hot shot hauler, and I got a roofing company calling me about wanting me to deliver shingles for them. They're having to pay $350 to get shingles delivered, and they're not getting them on time. So guess what? I saw the red Corvette. If you watch one of my other videos, you see the analogy is, is that if we're always looking for something, then we're going to find it. You know, just the same as people say, oh man, there's no good women in the world. There's no more good men. You know, there's just, you know, there's no good paying jobs out there or anything like that. No employer appreciates, you know, and nobody wants to pay anything. And, you know, there's just not good employees. And you know what? You're right. You're absolutely right. Whatever it is that you think, you're right, you know. Henry Ford said it best when he said, the man that thinks he can and the man that thinks he can't, they're both right, absolutely, okay? But there's an opportunity, okay? Not only am I gonna get 200 bucks for the dump trailer for their garbage, I'm gonna get a couple hundred more for delivery. Boom, how you like me now? That's what I'm talking about. So there's an opportunity, we're gonna take it. He called me today, I was at lunch, said, man, can you get these shingles from Home Depot and uh, we'll pay you a couple hundred dollars. And I was like, that's not a problem. We'll make that happen. You know, so, hey, if I increase my revenue each week by, we'll just say twice, that's going to be an additional $400, $1,600 a month. What can you do with $1,600 a month? Well, we could save up. We can go on vacation. We can make some repairs to the house. Uh, we could buy some stock, um, put some new tires on a motorcycle. I don't know what, you know, you would do with it. However, I know that I would love, I got two houses that I owe less than 25 grand a piece on, and I would love to get them paid off, you know. So that's what we're looking at is, is that, uh, you know, go ahead and increase this revenue and start generating some more. I'm already doing it. You know, I got a gentleman that's on backup in the neighborhood that he's got a dump trailer, lives about three blocks away. He's actually taking his out on location because all three of mine are running right now. Um, I got a buddy of mine, Bob, that's got one that he gives me a great price for a weekly rental. Um, there's two other people that I know that got dump trailers. You know, there's a lot of business out there. You know, John over in Milton and started his and everything like that contacted me, said, Hey man, I'm going to get the dump trailer. I'm going to do the dump trailer hustle and everything. I was like, great, whatever I can do to help. He was like, cool. We met, he's got a brand new trailer and everything like that. You know what John said? John didn't say, well, there's too much competition. I'm not going to do it. John didn't say, well, Robert's already doing it and everything, and, you know, so I'm not going to do it. John didn't say, well, there's other dump trailers out there, you know, I probably am not going to succeed. I met John when he was getting his first load and making his first dollar with his dump trailer. You know why? Because John took some action, you know. Same thing Parker. Parker calls me, tells me, hey, I'm going to do this and everything. I don't want to step on your toes. Really cool about that sort of thing. I get it. And, uh, you know, Parker's got two trailers that he's running, you know, so he, you know, I mean, it's out there if somebody's willing to go and get it. The other part is, is that if somebody's willing to serve the customer, you know, because when you are able to solve a problem, that's when you're going to be able to make some money. Otherwise, you're going to have to sell something that people really want, okay? And what I mean by that is, is, you know, you look at beer, cigarettes, sex, all of that stuff sells because that's stuff that people want, okay? You know, just the same as little Debbie snack cakes and, you know, um, going to a nice restaurant, getting a great steak and everything like that. You know, these are things that people want and they'll pay for those, okay? Just the same as, you know, somebody wants, you know, that Cadillac Escalade and everything, which is pushing, you know, $100,000 brand new and everything because somebody wants what the perception of somebody is driving that Escalade and they want that feeling to be seen in that car with me looking at them, 
Okay, so they're willing to pay for that because you know as well as I do, little Keo will get you from point A to point B just the same. Okay, hello, you know, so that's what I'm meaning by that. So find a problem, offer a solution, you'll get paid. It's Ryan o. Robert with the No Pay No Stay Network. I've included my email. If you need to talk with me, get with me, send me an email. I'll be more than happy to answer any questions, help you out or whatever like that. And I greatly appreciate you staying and watching the channel and our support. And uh, if you got an idea for a video you want me to do, I'll be more than happy to do that as well. Thank you so much. Have a great day.